I've decided I want to start drawing things that I am not good at. And I want to do it for 30 days, but I'm terrible at doing things over and over and over again. Not a fan, but I'm going to try. I got some watercolor paper cut. I got my sketchbook pencil over here. I have a couple of things that I would like to get better at, but I think I need to only just pick one. So maybe I'll just do feathers. Ooh, rainbow feathers. That sounds fun. Not a bad looking feather. I mean, it looks like a feather. Uh, I guess that's mostly a feather. Okay. But I hope at the end of this I'm going to be very proficient on feathers. Alrighty, that's feathers. You know what? Let me use my cheap old watercolor. See what's inside. Oh boy, oh boy. Look at that man. Here we go. All in all, I'm pretty dang happy with that. So, let me sign it. Well, that's day one. Paper. Pencil better. I think I'm just going to go with the I guess that is that. Hey, look, they're starting to actually look like feathers. How about that? I guess I just let it dry and then I can sign it and stamp it. All right, day 14. Let's see how many feathers I can make. So one on the internet that I liked, and I might have to use my H. Martins. I don't have pink watercolor. 
bit off center, but that's all right. too much. Hold on one minute. It's supposed to look like tie-dye, but it's fine. Just leave it alone and let it dry. Alright, okay, we're letting this dry. We're letting this dry. Let's try do some white. No idea what I'm doing. So I just do it. Because that's not too bad. That's interesting. I didn't really expect it to reactivate ink. I don't. I know. I'm so confused. But once it was dry, it was done for. This white is definitely reactivated. So far, so good. First, I put the border on crooked and tape. Yay. like tie-dye. I do like the way this came out. So we made two today. Alright, so let's do a recap of the first 15 days of this 30-day challenge. This is my first space one that I was attempting. I love the colors on this one. This one, I used what was left over from my ink for this one, and then thought I would try to make it look like it was sort of floating and bent. And apparently I skipped from the third, fourth, and fifth, and sixth day, because I thought maybe I have all of these. One, two, three, four, so... I messed that up. And then this one is trying to get a little fancy. This one I was trying to blend colors with water and it didn't turn out as well as I had hoped with all these little jagged edges. This one I was trying to make a rainbow and it came out pretty dang hideous. This one I really like, an abstracty rainbow. This one came out pretty cool. I love the little silver ball. This one, I used what was left over from that, and then just took my silver marker, silver paint pen, did a quick sketch. This one, I was just trying to do lines. It sort of kind of hurts your eye a little bit if you look at it too long. This one, I didn't color in because I just didn't feel like it. I thought it came out pretty cool. My first attempt at drawing a peacock feather. I also left that uncolored, and then I immediately drew another peacock feather closer up, and I'm not quite happy with the colors, but that's all right. On day 12, I decided to do an octopus holding a feather, and I'm not sure why an octopus has a feather, but it's fine. And this, I used some leftover colors, and then just with like a whole page pattern, and then to sort of differentiate the layers 
I added little gold edges. And then the next day, played around more with my gold deep pen. And I really like the way this one turned out. I think it's pretty cool. Watercolor, ink pen, and a gold paint pen. Oh, and there's a little bit of white gel pen. This one, I saw a picture of a cool feather online. I decided to try to paint it. I love the colors. Thought it came out pretty decent. It's really hard to get a good consistent black color. This one I was attempting tie-dye. came out alright. This one was some leftover ink and I decided to attempt to use some glitter. I'm uh, not really sure I like it that much, but that's alright. So that's the first 15 days. That will be the end of part one of my drawing the same thing every day for 30 days challenge. Feathers edition. So I'll see you next week for part two. Bye!